Hello, gamers of the Gear Report. I have a few tips or things I have to talk to you about today. Um, mostly having to do with uh, Major's Razor and Riggle's Lantern, the jungle items. Um, also, I have an RP contest for today, so all you guys have to do to enter to win is leave a comment below. Maybe we are uh, hoping that you win the RP contest, your summer name, uh, what server, etc. Follow my Twitch at twitch.tv slash the game report and subscribe. Simple. Those three things. That gives you a chance to win uh, free RP, 7200 RP. It's a great thing I do for my viewers. All right. Now to Major Razor. So there's some pictures of, uh, of the changes. So basically, first one would be that Major's Razor now build path is dagger 400 gold it's the attack speed item and hunter's machete um 300 gold plus 50 so it's 750 in total uh so total cost went up to 750 no longer gives armor and it now gives uh attack speed i i always i thought majors always gave attack speed but i guess i'm wrong riggle's lantern now builds out of majors razor a long sword and a dagger plus 140 gold uh, total cost remains at 1650 now transforms into feral flare so a new item is out okay guys it's an upgrade for riggle's lantern because i guess they felt that it wasn't a good enough item uh not enough people were buying it people were just thinking about the lizard brutalizer build or the uh riggle's or no what the fuck uh the spectral wraith into uh like zonias or sork shoes uh that was the main ap build uh so now uh, it transforms into Feral Flare at 25 large monsters killed with Maim. Maim's ability is basic attacks against monsters deal 100 bonus magic damage and heal 12 health on a hit. So the attack speed on Riggle's Lantern was increased from 25% to 30. Maim, uh, the heal increase, w uh, was increased to 12 from 10. And the increased gold from... Or, the increased gold from monsters is decreased to 30% from 40. So buffing its damage, buffing uh, its attack speed, uh, and its heal to tone back its gold gain, which actually that's fine, because then this item becomes more viable for um, sustaining from the jungle and then also going into lane. Also, since the item no longer has armor, it, it grants 12 AD, and that's why it's built out of a longsword. That's why it's in its recipe. Uh, then Feral Flare. Basically transforms from Riggle's Lantern after 25 large monsters killed with Maim. 20 attack damage from 12. Uh, it has 35% attack speed, so it has 5% more attack speed. Maim, basic attacks deal missing. Uh, I don't know what the fuck that is for. Uh, dealing Deals magic damage. 33% uh, against champions. And heal on hit. Uh, this damage and heal is increased by kills, assists, and large monsters. I don't know why why they wrote missing. That didn't make sense there. Oh, it doesn't say how much magic damage it's dealing. So it's missing. Oh, so it might be more than the 100 that it deals for Riggle's Lantern. That might make sense. Gain 30% increased gold for monsters. That is the same as uh, Riggle's Lantern. Places a stealth ward that reveals the surrounding area for 180 seconds. So that's the, th th that was on Riggle's Lantern too. Like, that's the same. And it counts as a gold income item, so you can only get it and not another one. Uh, pretty cool. Honestly, this makes getting Riggle's Lantern more worth it. And you can rush it so that you can quickly get these 25 large monster kills uh, with Mim. And then you're also... This does damage to champions. So it's... it's To be honest, it seems OP right now, but it doesn't actually list how much damage. But 20 AD attack speed and... Magic damage to champion, so your hybrid um, seems very good on, like, let's say, uh, Vi, Jarvan, all the attack speed junglers. Um, I could go into my rune page. I have one that has uh, the list of the attack speed champs uh, that you get attack speed on. Nocturne, Zin, Vi, Jar J4, and Shivana. Those junglers would probably do really well with the Feral Flare. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed everything I had to tell you about the new item coming to Summoner's Rift. Uh, there's technically some changes to Hymer and stuff, but this video is mainly about the new item. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and if you did, leave a like, maybe subscribe, and leave a comment about what you think about this item, if you think it's going to be OP, and if you think that the magic damage will be higher or lower or the same as Riggle's Lantern. I guess it couldn't be lower, but you never know.